Coming up in this week's episode. Yes, guys, welcome back to another episode of Unsigned, the journey to step five, a.k.a. the journey to the Premier League. And yes, it's cameraman Sean on the commentary today, stepping in for Christian. Don't worry, he will be back next week. You ain't got to hear my voice too long, so go easy on me, innit? Today, we're taking on Berks County away from home. A big, big game. Those of you that have been for, around for a long time, you'll remember last season, we played them in our second to last game. We beat them just about 2-1 but with two big missed opportunities. And some could say they played a big part in us missing the playoffs. So the boys today are out for revenge. We need three points today. So without further ado, let's get into the lineup and the pre-match antics. If you like, comment and subscribe within the first three hours of this video going live, you'll be entered into our kit giveaway to win one of our brand new kits. Good luck. They are bang up for it. So if we're not up for it today, yeah, we're gonna jump on break nine. Go and drive. Hey, but I need you to be busy. I do not want you just standing there when the ball is not going your way, standing there giving me this because you'll come off. These are, this is not the kind of game where we can be standing around. <coughs> yeah? I don't know about, I don't know what, listen, they're going to be on it today. Yeah? I'm going to support them, but when we are going forward, okay? We said it again, over and over in time. We need bodies going forward. There's no point, the last time we played that, when you played that CB Aldo, you're doing all that running, pressing the ball there. But who's behind them? Who's pressing them? I do not want people going in ones and twos. Let's hunt in threes and fours. And talk. Yeah. Show them left, show them right. Talk, come on. 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 All right, guys, and we kick off. We're in the beautiful white and black. Burt's County in the claret and blue. Come and looking like Aston Villa. Like I said, this is a big clash. They are a very good side near the top of the table and always pushing on. And they're through already. Very early on, number 11 is looking for the ball. He tries to cut it back and look who's there to clean up. But one and only Santos. He's one of them players that does that work that doesn't really get appreciated. Oh, wait, whoa. The Nilsson, he's won the ball. That's what he's saying to the referee. You can see he's clearly won the ball. I think it's a great challenge, but the referee sees otherwise. He's been given a yellow card for that. Burst County manager is very happy and we're not. Number five, he's played it over the top to number 11. He wins the header. Number nine plays a lovely one-two with him and now he's through. What's number 11 going to do? Oh, okay. Well, well defended. I was a little worried there, but it's cleared off the line by Toby and we've done well. They've got a corner headed in and look who's there. Santos. Once again, cleared off the line by Santos. And as I was saying earlier, a player that doesn't really get much recognition, but he does the dirty work and he does it well. Clyde into Yusuf here. What's Yusuf going to do? Lovely revy to Denilson, the junior. Oh my God. Saved by their keeper. That is an unbelievable save. Great play by us. Unlucky there. Yusuf, oh, what a player. It's so far. Hey, right. close your legs. You're setting a bad example. Kevin Gonzalez, back to, back to Yusuf. Can he cross it? Can he get it across? Ah, well defended again by Burt's County, but Yusuf is still on the ball. You can see the sideline. Excited. Yusuf beats his man with ease. Great cross, but no one's there. And Burt's County do eventually get it away. Absolutely hoofed that. Zach, well played, good defending. We move on to the next slide. Sean into Kevin. Kevin, tricky baller to Haas. Clyde's begging for the ball. He tries to give it to him, but unfortunately, they get it. Number 11's on the ball. Oh my days. What a pass. He's clean through number nine. He's beat Sammy in goal. Oh no, what's he gonna do? He cuts it back and Sammy well defended. That was way too easy, boys, to get broken down there. But we move on to the next clip. Yusuf once again on the ball. Who's he played that out to? Ryan. You know when Ryan starts galloping, yeah? It's peak. What a player. He just glides so elegantly. Played it out to Clyde, who's been brought down. Oh. In the box as well. Oh, we'll have to see a replay of that to see whether or not that was a penalty. Alright guys, here's a replay. Graham plays it through to Clyde. He chops back and it looks like he gets caught by the Burt's County defenders trading leg. 
Now, let me know what you think down in the comments below. But me personally, I think that's a penalty. But anyways, we move on. Kevin with a delivery in. Rayan is going to play it back to Kevin to get another cross in. Yes, he does. Kevin whips it in. And Zach has gone up for... Oh, my God. Zach and Clyde have gone up for a bicycle kick. All right, if that went in, absolute scenes. Their right back's on the ball. He's trying to play it over the top. He does play it over the top. But Santos, once again, how many times have I said his name? And now Rayan, another one. Absolute baller. What a pass. What a pass. Defence splitting pass. And it's 1 0 to the RB. Unbelievable finish from Clyde there. Doing the Ronaldo celebration. You love to see it. That's one of them cultured passes, you know. Look at that pass from Rayan. Splits the defence wide open. And then Clyde just said. I'm going to slot that in. Bottom bins have that. 1-0 to the RB. 45 minutes on the clock. Come on, RB. Very happy. The best time to score a goal, you already know. Best time to score is half time. And number two there, yeah, you don't want it. Yusuf and Santos, yeah, you don't want it with them two, man. Don't want it. And we go into half time. Like I said, 1-0 up. Thanks to that beautiful finish from Clady. And we have been the better side. We've had some great chances. I won't, won't lie, it's been end to end. But I feel we've deserved the lead. But let's see what the managers have to say at half time. Yeah, it's going to be an ugly game. But we have to be prepared to get down and dirty. Players on bookings, just settle down a little bit, yeah? Just settle down a little bit. Just watch them tackle, especially in the park. Because listen, the last time we played them, we finished with nine men. Yeah, do not shoot yourself in the foot and this they're game. They're going to wind up, they're going to scream oh, for everything. Oh, everything, every 50 50s. Won't be nice now. Can they break us down? I don't believe they can. With the quality we've got at the back and in the middle, they can't break us down. But they're only going to break us down if we start to get lazy. If we start to get lazy and we're not doing our job, that's when they'll start to find pockets. Yeah, you can trust him, 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 and him will win every single ball in the air. So they can, they can try to go over the top, but guess what? We'll win it. Support each other. Yeah. Support each other. Yeah. Oh, Support each other. Oh, stop, stop. Oh, 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 stop. And Rayan's there defending with defending well. Hassan's on the ball. Can he get a clear? Bit of a bad pass. They maintain possession. Should I say they retain possession? And Hassan with a silly foul there. Gives away a free kick. We've not been great with free kicks. They whipped it in, flipped on, and into the back of the net. I don't know who scored that. I think it's their number 11. Forty-six minutes, literally one minute into the half, and they've scored. Never needed to give away a free kick there, and it's just gone through all our defenders and into the back of the net. Unfortunate, but it's one-one. Kevin, out to Zach. Zach with a great delivery. Unfortunately, they've come back away with it. Rayan edge of the box. Oh my days! He tried one of them little curlers. Hey, number ten. What you watching, Kevin? Yeah, you are watching Kevin closely. I see that little back heel from him. Who's this on the ball there, number 11? I will admit he was very tricky and Hassan has given away another free kick. Once again, a silly free kick to give away. What are they going to do from it? Oh, not a bad effort. Not a bad effort at all, I'll be honest. Hassan plays the ball down the line. Yusuf, what are you going to do here? Hey, sent his boy to the gym real quick and then he's just chopped back on him. And is that a penalty? Ooh. As you can see, screams for a penalty there. He's beat his man and he's clearly been taken out by his man. Well, you let me know down in the comments below what you think, but I think that's two penalty calls there. Zach, right foot, left foot. You know he does it with both. Who's this? Rayan's on the ball now. Kevin, we're just keeping it, keeping the ball, keeping possession. He's played it to Santos. He's gone back to Sean. Toby's there asking for it. Toby, ah, oh no, oh no, it's 2v2. Number seven's away. He's gonna sweaty it. What's he gonna do? Great. Ah, oh, oh, is that cleared off the line? Sean celebrating, but the goal has been given by the liner. Burks County take the lead. They're two one up. Ah, this is too easy of a goal to be conceding. Seven just 
passes it across. Great touch there. He shoots. It looks like it's saved by Sammy. And then Toby, unlucky to not clear it off the line. You can see their fans celebrating behind the goal. You can see their players celebrating how much it means to them. They take the lead against us. Unfortunate there to concede. But yeah, we've been playing well. We know the boys can do well. Santos, their players absolutely pulling him back. And somehow, Santos has just been given a second yellow for that and has been sent off. Now, you know we don't like to talk about referees, so I'm just going to let you guys comment down below what you think. As you can see, the bench ain't happy. It looks like they're both going for the ball. I don't really see a foul there, but you let me know down below what you think. But now the boys are down to 10 men, unfortunately. They're calling for a penalty, but no. Zach has simply just sent him to the gym. David Lowe's membership, where is it? Rayan galloping. This is where he's at his best. He's been fouled there, clearly. Referee's giving it. But yeah, we're going to move on to the next clip now. Zach. Plays it back towards Sammy, number 11, chasing down the keeper, putting on some pressure on, along with their number nine. And he's tried to play it to Toby. It's ended up at that centre midfielder. Great strike, great save. Another shot, number 11. What's he going to do, Sean? Oh my God, it's hit the post. Very well defended there by Sean, I must admit. And here we go, cleared out towards Ray and Ray and flicks it over his head. Yeah, yeah, boy, 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 boy. It's peak, it's peak, it's peak. But we move on to the next clip. Clyde with a brilliant turn. What's he going to do here? He's looking for options. He plays it down the line. Plays it into the Nilsson, the junior, the Mata. And plays it back to Clyde. What's Clyde going to do here? Takes a strike. Oh, my days. Off the Denver bar. Great strike there by Clyde. Let's see a replay of that. Two touches out of his feet, onto his right foot. Wraps it. And it's hit the crossbar, unfortunately. We've got a corner. Delivered in. And it's hit off the Burks player, and somehow that is apparently a goal kick. Let's take a replay of that. Good delivery. It's clearly hit off their defender. I don't know his number. And gone out. But yeah, been given as a goal kick. Referee, I don't think he's seen it. Rayan on the ball again. He's had a lot of the ball. He's been playing very well this game, I will admit. Plays it out wide left. Who is that chasing it down? Bilal Bihi, our corner once again. Yusuf, great cross. Aaron, that's the equal. Oh my days. That was the chance at the equaliser. That was the chance. 2 1 with a chance like that, we've got to be scoring. But Yusuf, the dog, is on the ball again. Ooh! He's been taken out. He has been taken out. Let's see a replay of that. I don't know if it's a penalty. I will be honest with you. He's done so well here. Look, three man on him. He's beat all of them. And then it looks here like he's... Yeah, look. Hey, that's a foul ref. I'm saying a penalty. Let me know what you think down below. But we're through again. Bilal Behe chasing it down. What's he going to do? Can he get a shot off? Oh, my, oh my days. Oh, my days. This is coming like the England-France game, the amount of penalties we should have had. Bilal there. Listen, if he goes down, that's a penalty, but he's tried to be too honest. Number 11 with a cross. Comes out to number 19 on the edge of the box. Oh, my days, what a strike. I think that hit the post, you know. Rayan on the ball again. Listen, the amount of times I've said his name is a joke. He's beat like five man there. No foul given. They play on. Next clip, Toby plays it out to the young left-back Mo Abdi. I love this kid, man. What a player. I'm surprised he didn't go for a little step over there, you know. Yusuf, great cross. Oh, my. Oh, Clyde, he's so close. Jeremiah strikes. Oh, my days. I thought it was going to be a repeat of Mosey. Aaron with the strike. Great strike. Clyde there. Can he turn and shoot? And somehow that has been given as offside. Let's take a look at this replay. First of all, this is a great driven shot by Aaron. It might have even been going in. Clyde, as you can see, is clearly in front of their player, but he's given offside. And here, there I am on the camera. Yes, as you can see. A bit of laughing and joking. They're talking to the referee about cups of tea. And, then, and Rayan simply comes over and says, referee, can we hurry it up? But yeah, as you can see, he has been simbing for that. Their player taking the mickey, asking him for two sugars with his tea. And all it was was that they were taking time to restart the game and he asked him to, to make it a bit quicker. But yeah, we end the game with nine men. Sammy comes out. Oh, no, 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 no. 
Great finish by their number 11. It's now 3-1, so we end the game with nine men. Sammy's come out there. Oh no, it's now 3-1. <sighs> Not good enough, boys, honestly. As you can see, the boys are just in despair. Unfortunate there to lose this game 3-1, but once again, it's down to our own, our own miscoming, should we say. Um, discipline has been a big issue. And you saw it once again there. I feel like first half, we were the better team. And second half, we were playing very well, creating a lot of chances. But when you go down to 10 men quite early on, it does not help. And Burks County have come up the better team. But yeah, let's see what that means for the league table and see what that means for us. All right, guys, taking a look at the league table after that game. As you can see, we're in sixth spot, one place out of the playoffs. On the same amount of points as fifth, but they do have two games in hand. However, fourth, uh, Deportivo Galicia, they're three points ahead of us playing the same amount of games. So we do know that playoffs is still an option. I feel like we can go on a run of form, get some wins in us and really push on. But anyways, guys, that's the end of the episode. If you did enjoy it, please like, comment and subscribe. And like I said earlier, my first time doing commentary, please go easy on me. And we're done. Don't forget to tell your dad, tell your mum, even tell the snowman. Tell Santa Claus we'll be back next week. Johnny, it's not your missus. You can't sort out with him. He's a ref. I completely understand it. But at some point, we've got to stick together. We're here as a team, bro. Yeah, we travel here for an hour. We've got to have each other's backs, bro. It's not one thing where he's trying to talk to the ref and his own players, two of them are telling him to shut up. Say it, you can't do that, sir. Right, right, right. What you should do, your captain, you tell him, chill out. I got you. Ref, that's it. There's a different way of saying No one can be told. No one in this changing room can be told. Because bros are getting told, shut up. There's a difference between telling someone shut up and telling, bro, let me be, let me deal with it. Okay, so listen, what I'll do, you want me to go speak to the ref, slow the game every time, or we just get the f on with the game? Yeah, but there's so, the how many time. times are we going to keep getting on with the game and keep getting violated? No, get by it's all right, 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 it's you okay. gave it off. Yeah. How do you not speak to him? What do you want to do? How do I not speak to him? What do you want to do about this? You're going to yeah, get to I need to make sure like that he it. understands what I'm so saying. You wanna... But at the end of the day, you don't have to get in your heads, bro. We are here as a team. One, two, three. Oh, Come on. Oh, no.